Welcome to my weekly auction house guide, subscribers and viewers. In this video, I will be providing updates on what cars to invest in, what cars to keep a hold of, and also what cars to sell for maximum profit. Before getting to this video, feel free to check out my social medias if you need any extra help, especially the Discord server. And if you are interested in some random drift clips, check out my TikTok. The links will be in the description below. If you are new to the channel and you are interested in making millions in Forza Horizon 4, be sure to stick around until the end of this video. These cars are from last week's guide, or at least should have been in last week's guide. Get them sold as soon as possible because the Toyota Truna can be obtained this week as 80% of the entire series completion. The BMW A50 CSI was an investment car. And the Volkswagen number 94 IDR will be available next week in spring. I was going to advise what cars to snipe, but it would have made the video too long. Let me know in the comments if I should do a separate video on what cars to snipe. The Corvette C8 has been shifting from 20 mil to 16. If you have an extra one that you want to sell, I advise you to wait until it shifts back to 20 before selling. Same as the C8, the GT500 has been shifting in price. If you are selling and want to make maximum profit, wait until the price shifts for the higher. The number 64 370Z Formula Drift car has reached a new price of just under 13 mil. To be honest, it surprised me because the highest I have seen the price was 10 mil. The GMC Typhoon is just under 8 mil. Keep hold of them and fingers crossed they continue to appreciate. The Cyclone has jumped in price to be now at 6.6 .6 mil. It may have been there for a while. I wouldn't know because I haven't checked the price, but I think it has appreciated. If by chance you have multiple of these, that's an easy 4 mil if you get them sold. The HSV GTS was available either last week or the week before. It was once a 7 mil car, so buy about 3 or more if you want and let's see how well it appreciates. The Mercedes AMG GT 4 door coupe has depreciated to 8 mil, but I told you to sell at 12 mil because the price is unstable. Porsche Mori is now at 6.4 mil. I wouldn't advise buying any at this price, but you can still make a profit if it reaches the 12 to 15 mil range. The Tokyan Speed was worth 20 mil until it was made available. It should get back to that price range, it is just a matter of how long it will take. The Remark Concept 2 is now available in the Farzatan shop. So if you are looking to get one, wait until the price depreciates or you can use 600 Forza Ton points. The Shelby 1000 went nuclear after the auction house was flooded with them when it was made available again in the Super 7 this time. In time the price will appreciate but I would suggest you snipe these or less than a mil. If you are looking to snipe cars, take into account how much the car is worth and how much profit you are going to make. As I said before, if you want me to make a separate video on what cars are best to snipe, just let me know in the comment section.
car in the Super 7 this week. I don't think, well, I haven't driven it, so I'm not sure if it is worth doing the Super 7 for, but it is not that valuable, so I would advise investing. If you are new to the channel, you watched the video this long and enjoyed my content. Also, if it helped in any way, consider subscribing so you don't miss any of my future videos and give this video a thumbs up. If you are interested in making millions in Forza Horizon 4, click the playlist in the top right corner.